There are some records in this world you don't want to break. Like, say, having the world's longest case of hiccups. But the one record you do want to break is... Reducing the Frankenstein's eye jawbreaker to nothing but raw calories and spit in record time. It's the longest lasting jawbreaker ever engineered. Comes with its own carrying case and sound effects. Wow, it's also unnecessary. Ah, yeah, you bet. I've had this baby on order for weeks. It's guaranteed to last 24 hours, or your next eyeball's free. Plus all the endorsement deals. Exactly. I'm so there. But I'll need proof, so... <laughs> Milo Powell, courageous, square-shaped boy, prepares to take on the Frankenstein eye. Are you ready? Uh-oh! Flamingo! It's a kid in trouble. I'm not so sure. Why don't we check after I eat my jawbreaker? Ah! Oh! Duty calls, Captain! This doesn't look good, Captain. Max isn't in his bed. And it's way past his way early bedtime. Yeah! Huh? Hey, you're not the tooth fairy. Uh. No, Max. So what's the problem? <laughs> I lost my tooth, and everybody says the Tooth Fairy's coming for it tonight. So? So it's freaking me out! Think about it. This fairy collects used body parts. Boy, has he ever got the wrong idea about the Tooth Fairy. Setting him straight could take a while. To worry, Jawbreaker? <laughs> huh? Uh, I mean, Elizabeth. Uh, Elizabeth. I just got the quick fix to get us out of here. Mm. I mean, to... Put Max at ease. My oh. Sprite Idea brand Fairy Catcher. Also good for capturing the Easter Bunny or Santa Claus. Why do we want to catch the Tooth Fairy? To prove to Max that there's nothing to fear. That's genius. Ta-da! There you go, Max. I'm not sure I approve of this design. Don't worry. The Tooth Fairy can't touch you in this trap. But for it to work, you need to be sleeping. But I'm too sweet to sweep. Then focus on this shiny object from my evil genius brand hypnosis system. Delicious and useful. You are getting sleepy. That was fast, Captain. OK, we got to find directions for how to convince Max not to be such a chicken. <laughs> Be careful what you say. It may influence the subject. Like we shouldn't call Max a chicken because he might act like one? Exactly. We probably shouldn't mention any animals. Chickens, cows. <coughs> and we definitely shouldn't mention mutated chicken cows. <coughs> All we want to do is change Max's mind about a scary, creepy, possibly evil tooth fairy. That's silly. Who would ever be scared of a tooth fairy? <laughs> uh, Max? Where are you going? Into the night to take missing teeth! Ha, 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 ha! There! Solved! Max no longer fears the tooth fairy. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have an appointment with the Franken Eye. Huh? But don't you get the feeling that things are getting... Uh-oh! Uh -oh. oh! Worse? Worse? Try way, way, way <laughs> uber horribly worse! Ooh, and if I know my TV shows, it's going to get a lot worse. -er. <laughs> Looks like we've lost Max. He's fast for a little guy in footy pajamas. And not too fast for this! A stick? It's my Captain Hook brand fairy diviner. It'll gently pull me toward any fairies in the area. Like the bear. Oh, oh, that's way a little Did I catch him? We're too late. Max is already scared Tabitha stiff. Cool. Speechless? <gasps> he roughed up on a 
imaginary friend? The Tooth Fairy ripped the head off her favorite doll? That's terrible! <laughs> With so many kids losing their teeth from these jawbreakers, <laughs> we are all vulnerable. We must all set traps and catch him. <laughs> Trap-sitting copycats. <sighs> hey, look! Max left a note this time. <sighs> I'm on it. It's from the lawyers of Tooth Fairy Ventures. Max has to stop impersonating their client, or they'll take serious action. That's bad. Oh, <laughs> uh, we're talking about a fairy here. How bad could it be? Uh oh, flamingo! Not again! <laughs> okay, that's bad. Yeah, I'm looking for the Tooth Fairy Imposter. Imposter? Ha! I am none other than the Tooth Fairy! Kid, you're infringing on the Tooth Fairy trademark. If you don't stop, you'll go to jail. Forget it! I'm the Tooth Fairy. If you're smart, you'll back up. Waha! You know what jail's like, kid? It's dark and scary. <laughs> Captain, do something before this gets any worse. I'm trying. Think, bird brain. Think! We have to save Max from going to jail. Man, I wish that lawyer guy would just give it up. Give it up. Give it up. Give it up? Really? <laughs> Fine, jawbreaker. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? What's going on? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Is this yours? Very funny. I'll see you in jail, punk. Jail? What's he talking about? Don't worry, Max. I won't let you rot in jail. <gasps> what if I offered you something to make this little problem go away? I'm listening. <gasps> Your jawbreaker? When I became a superhero, I knew one day I'd have to make the ultimate sacrifice to help a kid in trouble. Besides, now it's all covered in pocket lint. Here's my offer. Oh, is that Frankenstein's eye? The jawbreaker with its own sound effects. Deal! Hooray! I won't want him prison! <laughs> no! You're not supposed to bite it! Look, kid, I'm a huge adult. I think I can handle this little thing. Again, aren't I? <laughs> How can I possibly thank you? Now I finally meet the Tooth Fairy. It's been a dream my whole life. You want to meet the Tooth Fairy? Yeah, who wouldn't? Oh, I have to rush home and put these under my pillow. Thanks, Captain. You're the captain here. Guess you saved the day again, Captain. Now, finally. It's just you and me. <laughs> Milo, you went over your 24 hours. But you broke a record, so they sent you a free jawbreaker anyway. <laughs> yes, Elizabeth. It's all about strength, sacrifice, and believing in yourself. Ha <laughs> ha!
I think our hero has taught us something about believing today. And I believe that's gotta hurt. Captain Flamingo, looking out for kids in a big way. Flamingo supports wildlife everywhere.